Hi guys, welcome back to the topic. This is my second look of our Halloween, Halloween themed face makeup and costumes, etc. So today I'm going to be showing you how I do my skull face. Um, pretty much all you're going to need is some black and white face paint or eyeliner or whatever kind of black and white cosmetics you have. Don't go out and spend a bunch of money because it's really just playing around. So the first thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to completely cover my face in white face paint because your skull has to be white. Here we go. You don't have to get around the eye because we're going to be covering that with black. So don't worry too much. So here I just layered up the white on parts of my face that were more prominent like my cheekbones and my T-zone. So that would really help the skull look if you would just layer up and make that a lot brighter than any other part of your face. So now that you've put on your white face paint, we're just going to set it with some translucent powder. So this is just a high definition powder from e.l.f. It doesn't really matter what you use as long as it's translucent. Okay, so now what we're going to do is we're going to create, we want the, the circle to be kind of soft around the edges, so we're gonna go into the black powder first, and I'm just using a Naked 2 palette, Urban Decay's, and the color is Blackout. Just softly kind of begin your circle. And with this look, we're gonna have the eyebrows sort of demonic in a way, so we're gonna bring it up just higher than the eyebrow on one side. And down under the eyebrow on the other side. Okay, now that you've sort of made the soft outside, we're gonna go in and we're gonna make up the deeper, darker, blacker inside. So basically, I'm taking my NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil in Black Bean, and I'm just going to go crazy in filling this in black. And then carefully try to get it in your waterline. Hence the carefully. So yeah, even though I did make a little mess up of my white face paint, just using that, it's really simple if you just take whatever you use to apply your face paint, just keep that near like a brush or sponge, and then you can just like go over the spots that you screwed up on, like I'm doing here. So now we're going to do the nose, and I'm going to just go in with my NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil in Black Bean again, just because it's really pigmented, so I just need my picture. You're kind of just making one line down like this, and then one line on the other side, like this. Oh, my hair's up. Sorry, that we had some camera issues, so we had to stop for a second. I just put my hair up, so sorry to surprise you guys. So if you've made any mistakes like I did, just keep your white brush on in it handy, and then you can just okay, basically just erase it. Okay, now for the mouth. What I'm going to do first is from the corner of my lip, I'm going to draw a line all the way up to my, just under the far end of this eye socket, because I want to make it look like a big creepy smile. 
I forgot to mention I'm using All May's liquid eyeliner here, just for a smaller controlled line. So now what we're going to do is just going to draw a bunch of little lines that will be our teeth. Notice how they start small and they'll gradually get bigger. And then we're gonna go in and make the top part of our teeth. So now, from the teeth part, we're just going to go make like, the gum lines. And it's just a really light hand. I just want to make... Just some lines under the teeth that look like your gums. Okay, now we need that creepy grin line that everybody gets when they smile. So you're just going to bring from, it looks like you want to pretend like it's starting from the top of your nose and going like this. So sort of just start wherever, just like this. Into that creepy little grin. And now we're going to do Part that really brings this look together is these demonic eyebrows, sort of. So you're just going to pretend like you're making this frowny face and follow this one frown line up, like that. And then just draw a real dramatic arced eyebrow, like that. Just gonna go in and make some more lines just sort of to make it look a little bit extra creepy. Just lines like and now that I've done sort of the small details I'm gonna go back in with my eye pencil and just kind of frame my face with black. Thanks for watching my take on the skeleton face. I hope you guys learned something or picked up a technique or two. Um, but yeah, I hope you like this. I hope you try it. And if you do try it, leave a comment below and we'll go check it out. Um, but yeah, thanks so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed all of our Hello Week videos. And we'll see you next time on the topic. Make sure you subscribe and like this video. Bye!